Pennsylvania, Ohio, Texas, Friday, Texas, then California, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, we hit the big five. Big five, Pennsylvania, Ohio, Florida, Texas, and California. Five states a day? Yes, we're gonna play time zone hopscotch, we fly with the sun. California's screwing up our sleep cycle. What sleep cycle? Five days, huh? Hey, you can hang by your thumbs for five days. There you have it, folks. Signed, sealed, and delivered the last five days of the Santos campaign. Some would say heartbreaking news at this hour. Once again, Leo McGarry has been pronounced dead by Dr. Elliot M. Gross of the Texas Methodist Medical Center. He was rushed to the hospital after a massive heart attack, his second in as many years. Vice presidential candidate, White House counselor and chief of staff, labor secretary, and decorated Vietnam veteran. The Chicago native played a major role in shaping every presidential election of the past quarter century. And we are unsure at this moment in time how the sudden and tragic death of Democratic vice presidential candidate Leo McGarry. Some believe that McGarry had considerably more weight and experience, particularly in matters of foreign policy, than the top of the ticket. More than one Democratic operative might be saying with the loss of this party eminence and elder. What now for the Santos campaign? With McGarry's name still stamped on every ballot. Yeah. Send her in. Yeah. Sorry to disturb you, Mr. President. You wanted me to wake you when there was a result? Do we have a winner? Yes, sir, we do. How about Secretary of State? No. You gonna go with Reynolds? Maybe. If I don't get my first choice. Who's that? That would be you. S Secretary of State? You've got better relationships with all of the important heads of state than I do. You know the diplomatic corps, you're respected in every capital around the world. You agree with me on foreign policy. And you are the best strategic thinker I know. I'm not asking you if you'd consider it, Arnie. I'm asking you to do it. Man, I hope Janet Spragans has her TV on. Who? Senior year, she beat me out for the last varsity spot on the swim team. Guess what? What? You win. This is Robert Though she did get Don Vogel to take her to the prom instead of me. We'll call it even. Nah, pretty sure Janet had to put out so Don would take her.
Where's Mrs. Barber? Already inside the car, sir. Nice speech. No JFK. No, but you've got time. I left something for you on the desk. Just some random thoughts. I look forward to them, sir. Make me proud, Mr. President. I'll do my best, Mr. President. Thank you, Mr. President. Thank you, Mr. President. What's next? Sir, the uh, Senate Democrats want you to move fast on the education bill. Then we can 